affirm the good qualities. How do we do this amongst ourselves? And how do we, how do we actually expand this for ourselves? Sometimes, as we see from Khadija radiallahu anha reassuring the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, sometimes you have to help someone affirm their own good qualities when they're questioning themselves. Now, of course, the Prophet sallallahu was not questioning his own goodness. When the Prophet sallallahu was afraid when he came from Hira, Khadija radiallahu anha reassured the Prophet sallallahu with his best qualities. When you see someone falling short, the Prophet sallallahu was not falling short. You see your child, or you see a friend, or you see someone that's falling short. Don't assign the bad quality to them. The worst thing you can do to your child is to call them by and say, oh, here you go again. We know how stubborn you always are. We know how you're always this and you're always that. Because that's going to stick in their minds. Your friend gets used to a certain quality. They start self-internalized self-hatred. It gets, khalas, I'm the, you, know who I, you know how I am. First, it's you know who you are in a bad sense, and then it's you know who I am. No. Affirm the good qualities. Call your kids by the best qualities that you see potential in them. Even if they haven't mastered them yet. It's okay. It's one of the things that you elevate your children with. Call them, say, you know, you're always caring. MashaAllah, I love how you're always caring. Let it stick with them. And let them aspire to that quality until it becomes a part of them. We do that with our friends. We do that with our families. What's our family defining quality? The Prophet some had a defining quality for a community. What is the defining quality that we want to have collectively as the Valley Ranch Islamic Center? What are those two, three terms that we want to hear that always describe our community? And if we're not yet there, how do we actually live up to those things? We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to allow us to have the best of names and the best of qualities in our individual, our family, our community lives and to allow us to live up to them. Allahumma ameen.